Hey guys, so in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to speed up your tutorials and also how to do a voiceover. Hopefully, I can get both of those in. If not, I will do a part three. So this is part two. Um, also, part one will be in the description box, so be sure to check that out. Okay, so really quick, how to speed up your tutorials. First, you want to click on Project. And again, I'm using Corel Video Studio Pro, and this is the 6th edition. So you want to click on Project, right? So you see this bar. There's a bar here. You can either use this bar right here. See my mouse? Or you can go down here and use this bar. This is the bar that I usually use. Okay, and that just shows you where your video is. where you Wherever you want it to stop, you can actually... Like say I want to stop right here in the video. I'm going to hit uh, these scissors right here. And this is just to split and clip. So you want to click on that. And as you can see, it split up my video, right? So say I want this part of my video, just this part right here, sped up. Because nobody wants to see all that adding your primer and all of that extra stuff. So... I'm going to speed it to where I want it to go. And I'm going to hit the scissors again. And as you can see, it split the video from this point to this point. So we're going to just click over here. Then you want to click inside the box. Right? You want to right click inside the box. Then you're going to see speed time lapse. Click on speed time lapse. Now inside of speed time lapse, you're going to see normal, slow, and fast. Since you want to speed up the video, you want to take this dial and go to fast. Now, however fast you want your video sped up, you're going to have to play around with this just to see. For me and my videos, you guys, I always go maybe to a little bit more than half so I stop like right here pretty much to speed up my videos then you're gonna hit OK so remember just this portion right here is sped up the parts that we clipped and split those are the parts that's going to be sped up anything after that will remain uh, regular okay so I'm just gonna show you really quick what we did you're gonna go to project and hit play Oh, and also when you are doing tutorials, this is very important. A lot of people forget this step. Right click inside of the box that we want it sped up. Just right click and go to mute. Because what happens is if, if you end up sounding like a cartoon when it's sped up and you don't want to do that. You don't want anyone to hear that. So you just go ahead and hit mute like I said and let's go back to the project and let's hit play okay so you see how you didn't hear anything and now all of a sudden you hear something that's because this is still untouched we done nothing with the rest of the video so I mean I hope that helps you guys. <laughs> I know this was a really quick tutorial. If you have any questions, leave them down below. I'll try to help you as much as I can. But that is definitely how you speed up tutorials. And if you want to reverse that, you can just undo right here everything that you did. Okay? So on to voiceovers. Now if you want to do a voiceover on your um video, you just you see this film reel right here and the little red button which basically says record click on side click inside that box now you see voiceover screen capture capture video all of these things but pretty much you want to learn how to do a voiceover so you can do this at any point just hit voiceover and now wherever you see as you can see I'm talking so it's showing that I'm talking and I'm not gonna hit start because I'm actually using a computer and it's gonna confuse you guys so 
Whenever you want to start your voiceover where, to wherever you want it to be, just hit start and you're good. So that is where the voiceover is. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, little short tutorial. Again, if you have any questions, leave them down below and I'll be sure to answer and help you as much as I possibly can. So.